the electoral cycle, every party is desperately looking for aspirants. Because without aspirants, you have no oxygen as a political party. So I found it a very, very curious thing. Uh, why would you not want aspirants to come to your party? What could that mean? And I did reach out to the person who put up <laughs> the, 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 and I was not able to get a clear answer, although it was on telephone. I found it really curious. Um, because any party that does not have aspirants is a dead party. You would think that everybody would be doing everything possible to attract aspirants to the party. But I think that's all as we can say, because, uh, you know, the party chairman did clarify, the party works with using processes and structures. These meetings, I understand, had already been sanctioned many weeks ago um, by the National Executive Council or committee of the party. So the chairman is, is pursuing what has already been agreed. Uh, by the national executive, and frankly, it would be very odd if you don't want aspirants in, <laughs> in your political party. What party are you going to have? And, and because there are so many parties today, I think any party leadership must treat aspirants with respect because there are so many options for people. Yeah, yeah. Are the meetings going on? Uh, I do believe so, yes. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Uh, I look, uh, uh, I, mean, I think that again, conjecture, I would like to understand, the, because this is an action taken by an individual, we, we need to figure out and, and probably get it from that individual why he took this particular action. Because you saw the rest of the senior management are not with him. I saw a statement yesterday by the chairman the organizing secretary, uh, the treasurer, uh, even the deputy secretary general disassociating themselves with, with that advert, meaning it was a unilateral action by one individual. Now that raises all kinds of questions, but I would not like to speculate. I, I would rather it is handled internally. But let me tell you, as practicing politicians, you know, we, 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 we are liable to sabotage all the time. Yeah. So you, you can't rule out sabotage. Again, I ask you, which political party does not want aspirants? So you must ask yourself a question. Why would a, a secretary general of a political party take an advert like that, saying, no, we don't want aspirants to meet? What, would be, what possible explanation can you give? Look, it's not a matter for me to speculate. Uh, his point that I'm not a member of PNU. I am not actually a member of PNU. I am independent, elected independently. I am a sitting governor elected as an independent. That means I don't belong to any political party. <coughs> Do you need to be a member of PNU? time by which people must belong to political parties. And I have said again very publicly that I am considering running for my second term on a PNU ticket. I have already said that publicly. Which means I will join the party and so on. But as of now, I am elected as an independent. So by definition, it means I don't belong to a political party. Mm. Do, you, yeah. do you see... Uh... Um, you see, uh, uh, Marathi, first of all, I am already elected independently, yes. which tells you I may not necessarily need a political party. That's what that tells you. <laughs> I am already in office and I'm elected independently. So plan B, in case of Any political parties would find me very, very attractive. 
as an individual leader <coughs> it also perhaps explains why i was recently appointed chair uh, <laughs> by the azimio presidential candidate yeah, that's right. yeah. so what you should so see Oh, there are many, many options. But I think what, what is a more likely thing is sabotage involving an individual. Yeah. And, and until the neck follows its own internal processes, disciplinary processes, I may not be able to comment. But as an observer, as a person with a bit of experience in organizations and in politics, that is sabotage. Why would a senior official sabotage his own party? Yeah. Uh, 